How is mommy ever gonna have another baby? Good morning, everybody. It is, what time is it? It's eight o'clock in the morning. I'm getting Scarlet breakfast. Tired, I'm really tired this morning. I got up and showered though and washed my hair. Um, I need to still put a little bit of makeup on and do something with this. It's been like air drying. This is my third day vlogging in a row. <laughs> I'm trying to like get a bunch of videos ready to go because my mom comes to town next week and I wanna make sure I have content for you guys um, so I'm not leaving you dry for like a whole week, but I also don't wanna be editing and working on videos while my mom's here because I just wanna enjoy it. I haven't seen my mom since I got adopted back in January, since I went back for the adoption. So that's a long time. That's like almost six months I haven't seen my mom. So I'm excited for her to come here. Anyways, today is Wednesday and I haven't told you guys this yet, but we started taking Scarlett to swimming lessons. This will be her second one today. Last week was a complete awful disaster. Um, she loves swimming. She loves swimming. We go to my in-laws and they have a beautiful pool and she has like the um, puddle jumper and she just like floats around in the water and she has so much fun. Loves swimming. But we get to swimming lessons and homegirl won't even get in the water. So this is kind of how she was at gymnastics and it took her a um, like three months <laughs> to finally get used to it. I already took out the bribing method because I want her to participate today so bad. Ever since we were at Disney, Disneyland, we went to the Disney Junior dance party there and there was Vampirina there. And ever since then, she's loved Vampirina. Anyways, there's this toy at Target that she's been wanting forever. And I've actually like, I, I was gonna get it for her anyways, but it has like a microphone and it sings the song. And I told her today, I said, if you participate with your teacher, then I will take you to Target and we will buy this toy. So honestly, I don't think she's gonna do it anyways, but I'm using the bribing method today because I really want her to participate. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. Here's Scarlett's breakfast. Grapes, a waffle, and then a hard boiled egg. Look what we got in yesterday. It's our KiwiCo box. We get one of these every month. Scarlett, I got you a present. This is for you. You wanna open it? You're welcome. We just opened our KiwiCo crate and basically they send you an activity box that's steam focused. They have different crates depending on the age of your child. So KiwiCo is a subscription box service. So you're gonna receive one of these a month. So these are the doctor tools. There's a stethoscope, some felt band-aids, a thermometer, and I don't know what you call that. And this is the other project they have. So these are stickers that you can decorate your medical kit with. Each crate always comes with a book. And this is a cute doctor's checklist. And then this is the book that I'll talk to you guys about in a second. I love this resource. And this tells you all about your crate and how to really give your child the best experience when utilizing this Kiwi crate. Wait, I think you are. You are. I'm how does Lilac's heart sound? Good. How does his eyes look? Good. Oh, you... I'll take the ears. Oh, his ears? Oh, I don't have any ears. Oh, I have ears. I have one, two. That's right. <laughs> This is her little lovey. I'm sure most of you are all familiar with this, but it's a Slumberkins and it's very well loved, but this always seems to be our baby that we take care of when we're playing doctor. So what I love about these crates is that there's a bunch of different things you can do with them. You really can just let their imagination soar and let them be creative. But this specific activity has really helped developing oh, her. Where am I put them? I don't know, where's another spot? <laughs> Problem solving skills, hand and eye coordination, and it's helping work on her fine motor skills. Look at that! Oh. Okay, so with each crate, you're gonna get this little booklet, and this basically tells you what your crate is focusing on for the week. So this one is the doctor's visit, and they're really trying to emphasize on empathy. Um, it talks about how important developing empathy is, 
um, how to teach kindness and which we all need to be teaching our children. If you guys want to try KiwiCo out for yourself, I still have that amazing offer going. You can actually get your first box for free. All you have to do is pay $4.95 shipping if you are in the US and if you're not in the US, it's under $10 for shipping. So really inexpensive and such a great activity for your kids. But in order to get that deal, you have to use my link down below. So I will leave it in the description box. I'm making scrambled eggs. I cooked four eggs in hopes that Scarlett will eat some of these too. Um, it's 10 o'clock, so we gotta get going to swimming lessons here soon. We are currently outside too, Scarlett's playing outside, so I'm gonna take my stuff and eat out here. Scarlett, what are you doing? Good? The egg. Eggs are delicious. Where are we going? I can't see you. Where'd you go? Swimming lessons. <laughs> yep, and what do you get to get if you are a good girl at swimming lessons today? What are we gonna go do afterwards? The Vampirina toy. Get a Vampirina toy, but you have to listen to your teacher today, right? And you have to get in the water. Scarlett, we need to keep this up here, okay? Remember, that keeps you safe. But anyways, we're driving to her swim class right now, crossing my fingers, it goes well today. How cute is this swimming lessons place? They have these houses that they can play in while they wait. It's so cute. What are you making? What are you making for me? I'm making a tomato. A tomato, yummy. Oh, this is the apple. Okay, we just pulled into Target. We just got out of the swimming lessons and the reason we're at Target is because somebody did so good at swimming lessons. Did you do so good? I'm so proud of you. You did such a good, hug -a you did such a good job. Anyways, she listened, she got in the water, she did exactly what she was supposed to do, and now we get to go pick out her toy she's been asking for forever. What are you gonna go get? What toy is it? A Vampirina toy. But I am so proud of her. I seriously almost teared up watching her do this. I don't know why, because I've never been like that. But anyways, it's hot and I have my AC off right now so I can, you guys can hear me. We're gonna go inside. Ready? So this is the toy she's been wanting. <gasps> She's like changing her mind now. <laughs> what do you think? Do you want the Minnie Mouse or Vampirina? You get one. Which one? This one. You want Minnie Mouse? Okay, maybe we can get Vampirina for Christmas or your birthday. Okay, my car says it's 117 degrees out, but I think it's like 105. Not that that's any cooler. Um, but I'm gonna turn my AC down for a second, talk really fast, and then we're gonna go. I got one of these um, like fruit holders. I've been needing a new one, and I've had my eye on this one for a while. It's $25, and it's gold. It's really pretty. This little basket was on sale for $5, and I'm gonna fill it up with a few things for my mom when she comes next week. Just like some essentials, like, I don't know, shampoo, conditioner. Um, tile and all that kind of stuff. I grabbed a wet bag because we're going to the beach. Um, we're actually going to Florida with my family in July. So it's, as of right now, it's just Scarlett and I. If Ty can work things out with, um, not his full-time job, um, but his side business that he does. Him and his dad are like the only people who run that business and so it's hard for him to leave. So I don't know if he's gonna be able to come with us, um, but we'll see. My doll. And then Scarlett ended up getting the Minnie Mouse, um, microwave instead of the vampirina toy but anyways that's everything we got we're gonna head home it's one o'clock and i need to get her down for a nap because at 4 30 i have a pilates class i'm going to i'm so sad i got this to go back here but it doesn't fit under my cabinets so that's really where i wanted it because i put my keurig away since i don't really use it anymore so i guess that's gonna have to go back Scarlett just woke up from her nap and we're sharing a bowl of soup it's just campbell's tomato and rice soup She's not happy there's rice in it though, but she loves tomato soup. Also, she refuses to wear a bib, so we just put a towel around her, so hopefully she doesn't stain her dress. We are just pulling in from the gym. I just ran to the mailbox. Look at this cute necklace I just got in. It's from a company called With Love from Katie. Mama, I like it. You like it, baby? It has your name on it. It's so pretty. I T C. It's rose gold and it has Scarlett's name engraved on it. I'm so excited. If you guys remember, I had a monogram necklace that I absolutely loved, but I left it 
in the hotel in Scottsdale when Nicole and I went up there and stayed up there. I've left it there and I've been wanting some kind of necklace that has something to do with Scarlett. And so I'm so excited that I have this now. It's so cute. Oh, and she gave me a discount code too. So um, Caitlin15 will get you 15% off anything on her website. So I'll leave a link to her website down below. You guys should definitely check her out if you're needing some kind of personalized jewelry or something like that. She says she stamps each letter one by one, making I each necklace you. unique. That's amazing. I love you. I love you more. I'm you. a buckle. You are a buckle. Scarlett a bath right now. She's been, she's been testing my patience this afternoon. So we haven't eaten anything yet. I actually placed an order at Postmates um, to deliver pita jungle. I ended up ordering some hummus and chicken and pita bread, but that's what we're gonna have for dinner. Ty is working late again. I feel like I've said that all week long. He's working so much this week. They have a lot going on um, at his job. That is a six, good job. But I'm exhausted, like I am hitting a wall right now. I'm so tired. But I have a lot of editing to do tonight, so I need to like, wake myself up. I've been putting a lot more into my editing, so I hope you guys have noticed that. I feel like I'm slowly learning how to put my personality into my editing a little bit more and I like it, it's exciting for me. But the point I'm trying to make is it takes me a lot longer to edit a video now because I'm just putting more effort into it. Not that I didn't put effort into it before, but um, just details, details. Hey Andy, hey bud. <laughs> what are you doing? Look at this cute puppy. Aww, you got nice ears. <laughs> You look so adorable. <laughs> this is the cutest towel. It's from Target, by the way. They have a bunch of cute ones. Me. What are you making me? Oh, this is my coffee. Oh, I could use a coffee right now, actually. Hello, uh, Indy. This is your coffee. This is my coffee? Yeah. That's yours. Tomorrow I'm filming the um, drive through challenge again, <laughs> except I'm filming it with Nicole. So if you guys are not subscribed to my friend Nicole's channel, you need to be. She is seriously the best friend I could ask for. But it should be fun. We're gonna film that together tomorrow. So it'll be on her channel, I'm guessing, next week. Tada! What did you make? A tower! What? Tada! I'm so proud of you. That is an accomplishment. What a life you have, Mr. Indy. I love you. I love you too. I can love more than one person. I can love Scarlett and I can love Indy. How's mommy ever gonna have another baby? Would you let me love another baby? Mm -hmm. You would? Do you wanna have a brother or a sister? Brother and a sister. A brother and a sister? Uh -huh. I don't know about that, girlfriend. Let's tell that and the brother and a sister. Let's tell that. Currently practicing gymnastics. <laughs> can you do tuck? Can <laughs> can can you do a tuck jump? Oh my goodness, she's wild. We just got our food in, so this is the cheese crisp that I got for Scarlett, but I'm probably gonna eat some of it too. And then this hummus with the grilled chicken on top. It's so good. It's a cilantro hummus. And then some blue corn tortilla chips. I also have grapes that we just had in our fridge that I grabbed. And then Scarlett's eating some beans too. And she's drinking some milk. And we are watching The Little Mermaid on TV. So we're gonna have a little um, eating party out here. It is finally bedtime. Um, I just threw down. It's like 8.30. I'm drinking this lemonade. It's from Trader Joe's. It's low calorie. Lemonade. This has 40 calories per serving, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna fill this baby all the way up. So my goals for tonight are to do the dishes and to edit two videos. So it's gonna be a really, really late night. Scarlett was extremely defiant this afternoon and I'm just like completely mentally drained. It's hard for me to get on her and it's hard for me to not give in. It, honestly, it's hard, really hard for me to discipline her because what comes natural to me when she's throwing a fit isn't the type of discipline that she needs, if that makes sense. 
Um, she needs somebody who's firmer and more direct and more stern, and that's just not me. And so that leaves me feeling defeated a lot of the days, and I'm kind of feeling defeated right now. Ty is definitely more of the stern one and um, like the no BS kind of person, and I don't know, I've gotta be more strict with her, and I'm trying, but it's exhausting. I don't know if any of that made sense at all. Um, hopefully you get what I'm saying. But anyways, motherhood's been hard this week, parenthood's been hard this week. Actually, it's been like the past couple of weeks, but specifically this week because Ty's been working so much, I haven't really got much of a break except for when I go to the gym. But I'm sorry if this is like be rambling or complaining, but sometimes you just gotta vent. But anyways, you guys, I have so much work to do tonight, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here so I can stop procrastinating and start editing. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you guys wanna follow along with us even more, you can follow me over on Instagram. I am super active over there. Don't forget to check out KiwiCo. I have their link listed down below um, in the description box and you can get your first box free. All you have to do is pay shipping and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.